What's up, everybody? Okay. What's up, everybody? It's your boy Mean here. This is my um when that hard drive broke on my NAS server, and I made a really a bunch of stupid decisions. Uh, and I need to spend three hundred dollars on a new hard drive, uh, even though they're all covered by warranty. Um, this is where that broken hard drive is, and I have to keep it. I have to keep it because my mom's work. We have a Ridwell, and they sort of cycle through like things they recycle once a year, and um, at some point they're gonna do re electronics recycling. And this is um, there isn't any useful data on here. It's it's you can't you can't get data off of here. So you know, um, I should probably drill a hole through it though, or something. Um, yeah. So I'm just hanging out. Woke up at eight today. Um, I put the chairs upside down on the table and I put everything up elevated and I ran the vacuum a few times today. Um, so that was pretty good. Everything's all clean, all the floors are clean, so I'm happy about that. Um, something I like to do sometimes is the vacuum can't get over into that corner. So whenever um, nobody's home and I really want everything to vacuum, I actually move that entire side table into that little corner and I move all my uh, shoes back there out and I move my air filter out in my chair and I move it all into the spare room and the spare room has a little lip on the floor so it can't get in there um and uh that's where everything that you can like roll or like move around goes like I put the trash cans in there too and stuff um yeah so everything was vacuuming today um I did a little bit of school work today <sighs> not as much as I should have done I woke up at 8 and I just ate a lot of food. I, I woke up and I um, had two slices of leftover pizza and I had four packets of oatmeal and I also had some chips and I also had some bites of quinoa salad. It was crazy. Um, I also had some coffee that I brewed, but um, it was all a little, it was all a silly decision because I should, well, I don't know. I, you know, my weight's just been going down recently, and so I'm trying to, like, eat a lot, so then, um, my weight doesn't go down more, uh, but, you know, it's, it's weird. Um, what else? I don't know. Um, does my face look weird? Is there something up with my face? Hold on. I'm gonna look at my face from, that's my parents' show. I'm gonna look up my face from few days ago. Do I look weird? No, I don't know. That's weird. Why do I look different? Um, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, anyway, anyway. My skin's looking a lot better. Um, I started using CeraVe facial cleanser. I used to just wash my face with water, but I realized I've sort of been like putting a lot of friction on my face and really overworking my face when I do it with just with water. So I've had to start using a product aside from just moisturizer. And I think it's pretty good because it's preventing my, um, again, that's my parent show. I think it's pretty good because it's preventing me from like, you barely have to even touch your face when you're using CeraVe. You put it on your face and then you just like put some water on your face and it washes off the, moisturizer along with the oils on your face and you reapply the oils with the Cetaphil and um, you know I've sort of just been doing that respectfully Res respectfully I've just been doing that um, so yeah um, today or yesterday I got paid paid um, it was just enough to cover my credit card balance you know of course I never spend any more money on my credit card than I have in cash but um, you know, uh, I was going to be down $300 because um, of that stupid jacket I bought. I was going to be down $300 because of, of a stupid jacket, right? Um, that isn't even here yet. Um, it'll be worth it when it's here and I forget the price of it after a year. But for now, it's stupid that I spent $300. I, I should never spend more than like $200 on a piece of clothing. Actually, I spent a lot of money on my boots and I actually think my boots were a good investment. But anyway, that's besides the point. Um, I was going to be down $300, and because of my check, I am now mid. I'm mid this month, and I'm like, my 
my net worth hasn't gone up or down this month. Um, I also moved an extra $900 into my Roth IRA from my brokerage account. Um, yeah, the reason why is because, you know, when you, it's just, an, it's important to have a Roth IRA. Um, that's so annoying. Why is that so loud? They need to make better mixing on shows. I know my parents don't listen to their shows this loud, but, you know, sometimes a song starts playing in a show, and it's like way louder than the rest of the show in a situation like this. And you're already watching it, you're immersed, you don't realize that the volume's gone up 25%, so you weren't reaching for the remote. But everybody else in the house is wondering why you're listening to music so loud in this show, when that wasn't your intention at all. Um, yeah, so then I finished a couple interpersonal communications assignments, and then I finished a couple math assignments. I did a math quiz, and I got a 6 out of 10 on it. It's over, guys. It's so over. My grade in the class is 89%. It's over. <laughs> um, but, you know, C's get degrees, right? Um, <clears throat> it was all just, like, stupid decisions. Like, I, I get it, like, a little, like, I, I do, like, a stupid, like, addition wrong or something. I swear I know how to do math, you guys. I swear I know how to multiply polynomials. Like, I know, I know how to do that. It's just, like, you only have 15 minutes to do the quiz, so you're kind of rushing, and you do have five minutes at the end until you check your answers. But you're already in the mind state of already having done that math. So you look at your answers, and you're like, oh, yeah, that's correct. But, like... Of course you think it's correct, because you thought it was correct when you went to the next question. So, what? like, what? I'm not gonna, it's not as if within this 15 minute window, I'm gonna approach these questions that I answered with a completely new mindset, with a, with a complete perspective shift. It's not as if a second pair of eyes is looking at my work. You know, it's, it's me looking at my work from five minutes ago, and I'm like, yeah, that's, that's the work I did five minutes ago. Yeah. I don't, you know, so I don't know. I just, I just sort of been rambling. Um, yeah, okay, see you dude.